CHPRC demolition crews have started the demolition of the 181 K East River Pump House. Crews used American Recovery and Reinvestment Act funding and a 200-foot crane to remove six massive pumps that once pulled more than 200,000 gallons of water per minute out of the river and into the KE sedimentation basins to cool the KE reactor and supply potable and fire suppression water needs to the 100K area. The six pumps weighed 39,000 pounds each and reached down more than 60 feet from the deck of the pump house structure into the river below. CH2M Hill crews have already made 18 picks including the six pumps, their six motors, and six auxiliary pumps. Now these 50-year-old workhorses of the K East reactor water system have been moved safely from the water's edge and put down on the ground. Next up are six matching pumps at the K West River structure just upstream. Most of the demolition work on the pump house itself will be performed from the river level where CH2M Hill subcontractor built a protected berm out of 7,000 cubic yards of rock in February during the Columbia's low water season. The berms serve a twin purpose, protect the river from demolition debris and provide the foundation for when CH2M Hill crews finish removing the structure this summer and contour the riverbank to match the surrounding terrain. Removing the pump houses is part of CH2M Hill's Recovery Act funded effort to remove facilities and waste sites to shrink the 100K cleanup footprint surrounding the K-East and K-West reactors.